Hello everyone. This is a rain day, um, so I'm doing a lot of work in the shop. Before you see this concrete pouring on this episode, I guess you could say, we're gonna be pouring the concrete in the footers uh, for the yurt, and we are reinforcing those footers, of course, with rebar, how you're supposed to, and um, I've been basically taking this little thicker rebar, but cutting these, um, bending them at four inches, they're about 20 inches long, and then these uh, other poles, they're about 22 and a half. What you're gonna see is basically, we're gonna wire string these like we did the uh, patio, and then this is gonna go in the ground. Each footer for the concrete will have two rebars going in with these wired, and that will help support the concrete. Um, it is definitely gonna be a firm foundation, but this is what we're doing today. Cutting rebar, being safe, wearing goggles, wearing gloves, but the yurt's coming along. So anyone out there looking to maybe build a yurt or um, you know, look at some tiny home living uh, with a yurt, whether it's part-time, a vacation, Airbnb, hopefully these videos are showing you kind of from the ground up what the work looks like. Um, and of course we're doing it all to code and permit friendly. So you might see a little overkill. You're definitely getting a good idea, hopefully, of what it takes to uh, build a yurt. It's hard work, but it's fun work. It's creative and you get to kind of make it as big and bad of the bone as you want, however big you want your yurt to be or however secure or, um, you know, there's a whole, a whole bunch of different ways to go about building them, I'm sure. Uh, we're doing it to code here in Rockdale County in Georgia. Um, but I'm gonna get back at it, keep grinding, keep uh, cutting all these, bending them, and uh, we'll get it the concrete poured here after all this is done. the rebar supports inside of the hole as you can see they're gonna be hammered in and the concrete will be poured in those so every single one of these holes that we put in all these footers there are 16 of them they're all gonna have rebar support inside It's getting there. How many more? I don't want to interrupt your process, your two-man team. I think it sounds like you do. They can cut that X bag open and get it.
Yep. Yeah.